Other than aperture, uh, other things that control the final outcome of the exposure of your image are uh, shutter speed and ISO. Uh, shutter speed is a really simple concept uh, and really easy to break down. And I'm going to show you first on this camera, and then I'm going to write it out uh, on the whiteboard. So I got my camera here. I'm going to set it to an exposure of 1 400th of a second, which sounds like this real fast. But as I dial it down, and let's say I go down to a tenth of a second, it's a lot slower, so on and so forth. Really just sort of common sense. It's one half, one, uh, one over one half a second. And then this is a full one second exposure. So if I were shooting something like uh, a race car race or a horse race, obviously an exposure like this, a shutter speed like this, isn't going to work. Kind of the rule of thumb is uh, one five hundredth of a second uh, is generally the lowest you want to go when shooting sports or action. Shutter speeds are an equation. It's always one over something else. Uh, you know, so some really very basic shutter speeds are one over a thirtieth of a second, one over a sixtieth, one over a hundred and twentieth, one over a two fiftieth, one over a five hundredth. And again, these relate back into your f-stops. If you're shooting something that's fast, you want a faster shutter speed. If you're shooting something stationary, you can use a slower shutter speed. Uh, another thing really to keep in mind though is that human hands really can hold a camera steadier uh, slower than about a 60th of a second. So if you're going down to a 30th, a 15th, a 10th, you're going to want to put your camera on a tripod. Uh, if you have enough light to work with and you can get over a 60th, you should be okay. One really important factor to keep in mind is every time you double the speed of your shutter, you're letting half the light in. So to compensate, you're going to have to adjust either your aperture or your ISO to make sure you're still getting the same amount of light. That's something we'll touch on more uh, in Exposure Basics.